fine. Waiting for the class starts. <laughs> Hello. Okay. Hello. 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 Good, night. Good evening. How are you? How are you today? I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. Bye. Yes. How was your I'm day? I'm doing okay too. How was your day? It's too hot. My day was too hot. <laughs> I because imagine. I'm still in San Miguel and did it. Yes. <laughs> San Miguel is usually yeah, hot. This is like fireball, you know? <laughs> yep. Yep. It, it's hot here in yeah. Lourdes, yeah, so really I can hot. imagine San Miguel. And, and how is the traffic and the people in, in San Miguel? We are with, on 39. 39. Yeah. 39 is hot. Hello. Can you hear me? Can you guys hear me? Yeah. For moments. Okay. Yeah, because I keep receiving a, a, a message that the internet is not too clear, it's not too good. Um, yesterday was a case because it was raining, but right now it hasn't rained all day. So, um, I don't know. Okay, so what's today's date? What's the date for today? Today is May 6th. May 6th. Yes. May 6th. May 6th. May 6th. Yes, today is May 6th. What was yesterday? May 5th. Uh, May 5th. May 5th. 5th is correct. Yes, May 5th. All right. So if today is 6, what's tomorrow? 7. 7. Um, is, Seven. It, Seven. is it a holiday? Yes. Yes. So, uh, yeah, it, it's Soldier's Day. It's Soldier's Day. All right. And uh, how in El Salvador, how do people celebrate Soldier's Day? Have a meeting in the square, Soldier Square. Yes. Yep. There is a, an, an event at. Um, at the Soldiers Academy, at the Soldiers School in San Salvador, in different places too. All right, so do you remember the topics we discussed uh, yesterday? About the... tips. About prototypes. Okay, so we spoke about comparatives. Okay, so we spoke about comparatives with short adjectives and long adjectives. Um, if I'm using short adjectives, how do I make the comparative? And adjective plus er. Okay. And what happens if the if the adjective is long? And more plus the we add more. Okay. So you put before uh, before the adjective. You need to write or say more. Yes. Are there any exceptions? Thank you. 
Are there any exceptions? Yes, for for goods, it changed the, the adjective and is better. Okay. Or the or the adjective bad changed to and is a word worse. Yes. Exactly. Okay. Um, and um, what happens if the adjective finishes in Y and it has two syllables? Um, change uh, a Y for E-R-E. For E-R. For I and R. Okay. So if okay, so if it finishes with Y, you eliminate Y, and then you put I E R, and, and that's why you see yes. pretty, prettier, uh, fancy, fancier, ugly, uglier, and that's how you do uh, that's how you do the comparatives. Are there any questions related with that part? No. No? No. Okay. So I'm going to assign you to be working in pairs. So you guys talk about uh, why you were absent yesterday because some people were absent yesterday. So maybe you want to share what the message of the president was. Okay, is that clear? Is it clear? No, can you repeat please? Yes, um, I'm going to assign you to be working in pairs. Hold on. So um, you guys will talk about the things you did yesterday, including why you were absent yesterday. Is it clear? Yes. All right. For the exercise. Yes, right now it's only talking and you will tell your friend where you were yesterday. Okay. That's good. Where you were yesterday. So I'm going to assign you to be working in pairs and um, what do you call it? Here we go. On. Hello, Nelly. Can you hear me? Hello. Yes. Hello. Hello. Hello, Dan. Hello. Hi. Hello. All right, there you go.
ਵੀ ਮੇਰੀ ਆਹੋ ਅੱਛਾ ਯੂਰਪ ਮੇਰੀ ਨੈਸ਼ਨਲ ਮੀਡੀ ਸੋ ਦੈਨ ਹੈਵ ਯੂ ਸੀਨ ਦ ਨੈਸ਼ਨਲ ਮੀਡੀ ਨਲੀ are you asking me um he told about the teacher how do you say cadena nacional national chain national chain okay yes. national chain yes okay national chain that's great okay So what did they say in the national chain? That we can go He's, that we can get out for for about the quarantine. We were in class. Yeah. Right. You I don't three, remember too much about But did you watch the news today? Mm. Yes, I read the decree Okay. Mm, not too much because because I have work all day today. Oh. Okay. So you you're uh you didn't have much time to watch the news. Oh, uh actually um I have end and my 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 labors at 9. <laughs> 9pm. Yes. 9 p.m. Okay, you were taking a lot of calls? Um, not too much today, but yesterday it was very moved. Okay. Too All right. Good. All right, let because me Because it's it, uh -huh. Yes, Alan. Because it is uh calls. Oh. It's a because it, it's it's calls about uh these calls are about uh jan janitorial services and okay. persons so calling the, the people are calling about uh, uh how much will they pay for a janitorial service in a building or in an office on a business to business so that way okay and, and do you guys charge per hour or how how do you charge What what do you mean teacher? I, uh, I like do you mean. guys do you guys charge per hour or it depends on the size of the place where the janitor will go? Uh no, it's it's charge per hour. Okay. For an hour, yeah. All right. That, it's that because it's a bundle. You you have uh you have janitorial services for for one week in a bundle of Uh, for example 300 dollars but this bundle includes windows uh, doors how you say alfombra <laughs> i don't rugs. remember rugs rugs uh, or carpets rugs, right and uh -huh. carpets uh, floor all kind of floor and dogs <laughs> okay so so the client decides uh what kind of service they will receive or they need uh, yes but but the most uh, sell it it's the most sells is a bundle for dogs <laughs> okay all right good to clean the their to clean their their pets that's uh, okay it's a bundle but that is most selling all right good let me check another room and Hi. but basically uh, he he talked about uh, like teacher i how do you say uh, reglamentos rules o lo que estipuló cómo decir lo que estipuló el presidente ayer Okay, uh, okay, so uh, he talked about what the president expected. Yes. Mm -hmm. 
what the president expected. What the president expected. Yes. And, and recently and in social medias, I, I could watch um, some post about the public transportation um, are you speaking a little yes. bit. did you guys finish yes okay yes. and there is no more no more talking not much not much <laughs> Okay, let's go back to the main session. Okay. Hey, teacher. Yes, sir. Ah, talking about. <laughs> okay, did you guys finish talking? Yes. All right, let's return to the main session. Okay. All right, did you finish talking about the activities you did uh, yesterday? Yes. yes, teacher. All right, so yeah. let's go to, um, let me see this here. Share, minimize, minimize. Hmm. Hold on. Give me a second. <laughs> Give me a second. My goodness, I had this window open. So I could do something in the platform with you guys. Temporary error, Gmail, Gmail, Gmail. Oh, it's gonna rain. That's great. Where are you? In San Diego. <laughs> oh. I was I was hoping you would say somewhere near Lourdes. <laughs> it, 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 no. rained, it rained yesterday here while we were in class. Really? Yes. Um, so I thought you would say that you were near here. But San Miguel is a little bit far from here, actually. Yes. <laughs> what, time, what time do you wake up, Alan? Now that you're in San Miguel. I, I usually wake up at 7 or 7.30. Okay. Naturally, or do you need uh, an alarm? No, naturally. Naturally. Okay. Yes. Let's see, fill in the blanks. I think this is the one. It should be. So, teacher, can I make a question? And so sure. I have a, a little trouble with, a, with my platform app okay. in, my, in my cell phone. Okay. I couldn't, I couldn't listen uh, all the, all the Exercises? voice Exercises, uh-huh. Yes, or or the, or the audios. Yes. So, I I don't know what I what can I do to to hear. It. Okay, send me a message. Send me a a message to my WhatsApp, and I'm going to give you the name and the number of the person who's in charge. You explain to this person what the problem is, and he's going to tell you what to do. Okay. Yes. 
All right. Uh, any other questions, Alan? No, no. Okay. So send me a message, and I'll and I'll um, I'll send you his name and the phone number. Okay. I'll I will do it in after after the, the class. All right. Good. All right. So let's check. It says fill in the blanks with the correct form of B. What is number one? Where are, where, are are you, you where are you from, Teresa? Okay, uh, where are you from? Okay, what about number two? Is. Is. Okay. Is. What about is number three? Is. What? What is your well, map? Is your Is. Yes. The word is is. What about number four? Are Maria and Brian, are Maria and Brian, Brian from Canada? Are Maria and Brian from Canada? Are Maria and Brian from Canada? No, from yeah. England. Okay, now the second part, complete the following conversations with simple present. Where do you work? Do you work? Where, where do, you, do work? you work? Okay, where do you work? What about the next one? What does he do exactly? Uh -huh. What, what does, does he do exactly? Do. And where does she goes to a school? Go to school. Goes. Go or goes? Goes. Goes. Go. 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 Where do you go, go to school? Okay, but the question is about she. Where does she go? Uh, where does goes. she go? Go. Go because there are there is a uh, auxiliary for uh -huh. the. Yes, we have an auxiliary does, so the form of the okay. verb stays base form. So let's send it. Where does she? Oh, I'm sorry. Where uh, does she go to school? Where does she there go? we have it. All right. Are there any questions with um, with this uh, questions? Are the answers clear? Yes. Yes. All right. So I made a mistake in the last one. Let's see the next part. Circle the word. Nice to meet you, Rich. And what's your last name. Your last name. Uh -huh. All right. Then we have number two. My last name My is last Parker. Name. My last name is nice. Parker. It's nice to meet you too. Okay, good. Uh, number three. Her. This is this my is new friend Elizabeth. Her. Everyone, everyone calls her, her Beth. Beth. Her. Okay, oh, everyone calls her Beth. Hi, Beth. We're the Johnsons. Our first names are Frank. First names Our first are Frank, Frank and oh. All right, all right, good. Second part, same thing. Johnny Depp is my favorite actor. Is I like, like him a lot. lot. Yes. I like him a lot. Like him a lot. a lot. Music videos aren't very interesting. Do you like, like them. Them. them? Them. What about number three? My favorite TV program is Survivor. What do you think of? It. Oh, it. 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 Yes. It. So we click here and we send it. So uh, are there any questions about these answers? Are no. the answers clear? Yes. All right. So let's go to uh, our next part. All right, so now we go with time expressions. I sleep to at at at, at, 10, at 10, 10, 10 p.m. At, at 10 p.m. on weekdays. Uh huh. Now you can say until 10 p.m. on weekdays, and that will be valid. Uh, number two, John gets home late at night. At night. At night. At night. What about number three? They have lunch 
On Saturday. On Saturday. On Saturday. On Saturday. Uh -huh. on Good. Saturday. Number four, I go to bed around 11. In the evening. 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 What about in number five? In the evening. We have, we have class, class in the morning. morning. In the 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 morning. Right, good. In the morning. Now, fill in the sentences with demonstrative pronouns. Uh, do you remember what the demonstrative pronouns are? This, this, those, that. Okay, so we have this, that, this, and those. Some of them are singular far, singular near, plural far, and plural near. So how much is this what? This what? This what? This what? Watch. What about the second one? Look at. Look. At this purple, look at, look at this purple jeans. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Okay. Look at those purple jeans over there. Okay. I I heard different answers. Now look, look, pay attention to the following. When you say over there, that means it's not near you. So look at those purple jeans over there. Aren't they stylish? Even though we're talking about one pair, this pair comes in the plural form. So you're supposed to say those purple jeans. Is it clear? Okay. What about number three? I like this. This. These. These. Uh -huh. So remember that this one here, the first one sounds like Z, these, and the second one sounds with letter S. So you say this. So these. pronunciation is different. So I like these gold earrings. They look great on me. What about number four? Excuse me, I like that. I like that. That, 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 that. I like that, that cap. Okay, let's try that. And she likes. She likes um, this. This glaze. Those. Those glasses. 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 Those we're talking about there is a distance between the person talking and where yeah. the glasses are. So it's, it's not near. Those. So what is the right answer? Those. 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 All right. So let's try those. Let's see how it goes. All right. So we, all the answers are good. Are there any questions about um, these exercises? No. 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 All right. So let's go to the next one. This one is about reading. Okay. So I need a volunteer to read uh, this uh, email, please. Can okay. you see it? Yes. I. I. All right. Anybody? I. I. All right. <laughs> Hi, Ernesto. In your email message, you ask, ask me, what do you, I do every day? Well, I am a student at the University of Michigan. I really like my classes. I study computer science and Chinese. I go to school around 8 in the morning on weekdays. Around noon, I have lunch with some classmates on Monday and Friday, I go out in the gym before my classes, and I the late, late afternoon on Saturdays and Thursday. My friend Daniel and I have part-time jobs. We work in the school cafeteria, and I study in the library every week, weeknight until about 2 a.m. I'm full-time student, and I do, don't have time to watch TV. 
And what do you do? Send me another email, please. Your new e-friend, please. All right. Are there any, thank you. Are there any questions about vocabulary or pronunciation? No. No, is everything clear? Uh, what is the meaning? Uh -huh. uh, new e-friend. Okay. Uh, the internet. Yes, it's like you don't know this person like face to face, but only maybe by email, by Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. It's just someone that you know by mail, by the computer. Okay. Thank yes. You. Sure. Any other questions, class? No? No. No. Okay, so Ernesto is Chris what? New friend. New friend. Okay, new friend. Okay, new friend. Chris is a... Um, Full-time student. Full-time student. All right, a full-time student. What about Daniel? Chris friends. Daniel is Chris friend. Work in the library. Okay. Works in the library, exercises every day, or is Chris friend? Is Chris Works with friend. Daniel. Okay, uh, so which one is correct? One, two, or three? Three. Three. Okay, let's check number three. number three. And on Tuesday and Thursdays, Chris? Works with Daniel. Works, Works with, with Daniel. Daniel. All right, so let's check. All right. So the answers were good. Are there any questions uh, about the answers? No? No. No. All right. No. So let's let's go to the next section. I think that was it. I'm not sure. Yes. All right. So let's um knowledge check. Do you like rap? All right. So here we go. Now we go with the conversation here. All right. Um, do you see the pictures? Yes. 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 Um, yes. Do you recognize them? Eminem. Eminem. Uh huh. Eminem. Eminem. And who's the other woman? Celine Dion. Uh huh, Celine Dion. Do you remember her nationality? Canada? Yep, she's from Canada. She's Canadian. Do you remember her husband? No. I don't know. No. I don't know. No. Well, her, no. Her husband was very rich and he died and. Uh, Next thing you knew, she was with another person. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, all right, uh, so we have two people. We have Tom and we have Liz. Um, I will need two volunteers, but just before you start reading, remember that the question mark indicates that your intonation has to be of a question. The exclamation mark, uh, is it has a function too. Your intonation has to be different. What's the function of a comma? A pause. To make it's a, a pause. pause. And the period? A long pause. Yes. All right. So, can I have Tom and Liz? I am Liz. Okay, Tom, very good. I will Tom. I will be right. Tom. Okay, Eric, very good. Eric and Pamela, one, two, three, go. Eric? Eric. Um, excuse me. Um, do you like rap, please? No, I don't like it very much. Do you? Yeah, I don't. I do. 
I am a big fan of Eminem. I think I know him. Does he play the piano? The piano? No, he does. He's a singer. Oh, I guess I don't know much about rap. So, what kind of music do you like? I really like pop music. Goose, your favorite singer? Celine Dion, I love her voice. Do you like her? No, I don't. I don't like pop music very much. All right, good, thank you. Any questions about pronunciation or the meaning of words? No. Is no. everything no. clear? All right, good. So before we go to the explanation, can you please refresh my memory and tell me what the differences are between do and does? Do is does. for first person. Okay. You and we and they. And does is for third person, he, she, and it. Okay. Now, if we talk about the verb, that your answer is good. Uh, so do is for I, you, we, they, and does is for he, she, it. Now, when you make a question, what happens to the main verb? Anybody? For, for, in, for infinitive? Okay, uh, so do you like rap? Uh, it's the does. verb it's in in regular form okay uh what is the right word to say that uh, do you guys remember the word base form yes okay so we use uh so what's the function of do and does what do they do for auxiliary. What is it? For auxiliary. Yes, very good. They are auxiliary. In which tense do you use do and does? For present. present. Okay, what present? Simple, Simple present. present. Simple present, very good. What happens when the information is negative in the simple present? What auxiliaries do you use? Doesn't. Don't and doesn't. Don't and doesn't. Now, what happens when the information is positive? Do you use or do you need auxiliary do and does? No. No, we no. just change the verb. Okay. So you said uh, he goes to work by bus. He works uh, five days a week. He has a nice car. He has three brothers. So whenever you're using positives, uh, do and does, it's not necessary for them to be there. So you're gonna use do and does to make questions. If the information is negative, you will say don't or doesn't. If you're saying something that is positive, then you will use uh, just the verb. You're not going to use do or does whatsoever. Uh, are there any questions about this conversation? No, no. No. Okay. No. no. All right. So that is the, the introduction that we have for, um, for doing does. Let me see this here. And here we have information that explains um, how you're supposed to use do and does. Uh, the first three, well, all of them are questions actually. Uh, if you want to make questions in the simple present about actions, you will have to use do and does. So you will have to say, do you like rap? Yes, I do. I like it a lot. Or you will say, no, I don't. I don't like it very much. Does he play the piano? Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. That's a short answer. 
And then you have the other one, question number three. Do they like the Beatles? Yes, they do. They love them. No, they don't like them very much. Now, if you, if, if you expect the answer to be yes or no only, then you're gonna have to use do or does at the beginning. Now, if you want very specific information, you will have to be a little bit more specific and you will make questions like, what kind of music do you like? I like rock a lot. What does he play? He plays the guitar. And what do they like? They like you too. Um, are there any questions there? No. 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 Okay. No. Now, do you remember this last part here? Object pronouns. Me, you, him, her, it, us, and them. So they gave us $20. I told them the meeting was going to be tomorrow. I told her that she needs to come back tomorrow at 9 a.m. Now, you use object pronouns to indicate who receives the action. Is that clear? Yes. yes. All right. So um, this is something that you have in the platform. Now let us, um, do you see the screen? Yes. You see yes. the image? Yes. 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 Is it legible? Yes. Yes. All right. Let me take a picture and send it to your to the WhatsApp group. Give me a minute. Do, does, doesn't. I didn't even click and it took a picture. Da -da -da, nine to 10. Did you receive it? No. Not yet? No. Okay. Not yet. Yes. No. Okay. Yes. All right. So I'm going to assign you in pairs again. Um, some of you guys incorporated uh, later, uh, a little bit later than nine. So I will have to make adjustments um, to the way that I was doing the pair work assignment. So let me see this here. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I guess you guys are okay. So here you go.
Yes, they they do. Yes, they do. Yes. Number eight is when those negative. can come home from school. Yes. What time? This is possible. Okay. When does Pam come home from school? What time do you usually go to school? John doesn't time his room every day. Eric, are you there? Yes, dear. Hello. Okay. Yeah. It does. No, they don't. It does. That's all. Okay. Do your little sister like to play with the doll? What number are you doing, Pamela? Number 12. 12. Uh, does your little sister like to play with the doll? Good, very good. How much time do you spend at the studio? Good. Teacher. Yes. Uh, answering. <laughs> Okay, which number are you doing? Uh, four. 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 Okay. And you doesn't like to play volleyball. Okay, all right. The, the five. Five. Do, do you have your mother at home? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Uh-huh. Does Helen take a shower in the morning? Ah, see? No, she doesn't. No, she doesn't. Mm -hmm. Same. Uh, do the boys light? play the computer games? Yes, they do. Yes, they do. Eight. When don't, when don't, uh, when don't span come, can home from school? No alcanza a ver si es. Crucita or eight. Which number? Eight. Eight. It's plus. Yeah, it's plus. Ah, it's plus. Entonces, sí, era, uh, ¿dónde está? Eight. 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 No la veo. It's near to yellow uh, point. Star, yeah. Spawn. How I can have from school? When does Pam? When does Pam? Pam. Yeah, can Pam. Have, Pam can have from school. Right, right. Nine. Nine. What time do you usually go to school? Ten. Uh, John does doesn't. Uh, old car. <laughs> yeah, really. Yeah. I would want that it's a BMW, yeah. but it's it's a BMW three three hundred twenty eight. <laughs> oh. But it's not too 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 new. It's from. 2012. Oh, but beepers, 
Beamers uh, 2012, they look pretty nice. They look pretty decent. <laughs> uh -huh. you want to, do you want to see, teacher? <laughs> yeah, sure. Send me a picture when you can. <laughs> yeah, okay. I, I'm going to show you after after the all right good the class so good. let's continue <laughs> <laughs> number 18 18 the teachers and the the other part so which which number are you doing right now uh, 15. 15? Yes. Okay. Is is Eric talking? Yes. Okay. Good. Uh, does Ben use high PC every day? Do you like rainy weather? Um, since number eight again. Number eight. When does Pam, when does Pam come home from school? Uh huh. What time do you usually go to school? Yeah, you know, doesn't tidy his room every day. Does your parent allow you to go on the uh, in the evening? No, they no, don't. They do. Okay, which which number were you doing? Uh, number eleven. Eleven. Okay, one more time. Eleven. Who did number does your, eleven? Does your parent allow you to go out in the in the evening? Okay, now when you say your parents, is that singular or plural? Plural. Plural. So what will be the right form? Does. Does is for he, she, it. Uh -huh. So in this case, when you say your parents, you're talking about your mom and your dad. So what would be the right answer? Do your parents. Do your parents, yes. Do your parents. Yes. Do your parents. Good. Uh, Eric is Hello? number 19. Uh, does not appear to me. Mm, no. Is do you do you plan to go by car or by bus? <laughs> Claudia. Um, it's positive. Eh? Is does man believe it in? Yes. Twenty one. Positive. Does they speak Spanish? Okay, when you say they, what is better than does? They. Okay, but what would be the auxiliary uh, uh they for, do? Aha, uh -huh. so if it's a question. Do they, they speak? Exactly. Oh, yes. Do they? See, yeah. Do they speak Spanish? Yes, they. They what? What's the answer? Yes, they do. Good. Very good. Yeah, they do. Okay. Two, eight. Or do you like to play tennis? Does she go in for figure skating?
Ladies and gentlemen, can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, were you able to practice in the last um, exercise? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. All right. So we're going to verify all the answers first thing tomorrow when we meet again. So once again, thank you for your time. Um, I don't know if you guys have any questions about today. Yes. Uh huh. What What is the tidy meaning? Uh, one hour. I, is that your question? How much time is the yes, class? Yes, tidy or tidy. Um, no. Oh, tidy. Tidy, okay. yes. What what number are you doing, uh, Lorraine? Wait, 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 wait. Is um... is the sentence ten? Ten, John. Tidy. Yes. yes. Is the... John doesn't tidy his room every day. It, tidy means clean. Keep it clean. Oh. Yes. Okay, thank you. Sure. Any other questions? No. 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 Okay, so let me say thanks again for making the space, making the time. So I will see you tomorrow, same place, same time. See you. Good night. All right. See Have a you. Good night. good night for everybody. Bye. 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 Be safe. Good night. Good night.